All right, guys, what's up? Matt here. Let's keep this quick because I got some work to go do today, right? Because you got to make that money. Get on the horse every day. Anyways, lawn care season started. Thought I'd give you a look at my trailer setup, truck setup, whatever, 2015. Got a new Ferris on the back there, so we'll take a peek at that. First off, VR600, some rakes and stuff. And I do use a trash can, but I use the keep tarps in. I just put a strap over it, and it's good to go. And rakes, I always put the heavier rake on top, or rakes or shovel, or I got some more shovels in the garage I use. Keep it from flying out, right? Trailer's a 5x10 carry-on. Uh, Half-inch plywood sides, don't even ask why I cheaped out. Just let's not go there. Put on with U-bolts. And on the inside, we used whatever those things are. And uh, locking nuts and cut them off and that's it. Also when you do that in the corners you need to brace it up so there's a brace right there. We got a tractor supply toolbox. It's a frame of course. You always want an A-frame if you're gonna be carrying anything. You can start the weight like these mowers. It's like 20 over 2200 pounds with the trailer and also you want something sturdy right uh over here on the side we got the Echo SRM 225s. We love the trimmers. Sometimes they could have more power, but for the most part, they get the job done for general, uh, like my yard here, edging and general trimming edging. They're perfect. You want to get in some tall stuff, maybe like FS90R uh, or KM130R by steel. Those would be a little bit better choice in that respect. So, in the front here, we got my mower I got last year. I was using last year. It's a Toro 36 inch belt drive Pro Line. It's a great mower, it's just kind of a pain with the belts sometimes. Don't, you, like, oh, they, they slip when it's right. No, the tires slip on the grass because it's what I've never had a problem with the belts themselves actually slipping. So, that's just my two cents in that. Uh, any mower would have a problem when the grass is wet, but it's a floating deck, fab deck. I would never buy a stamp deck on a bigger mower. Gravely 34s are, in my opinion, a little different because they... They're a smaller mower, these things, you they you whip them around and stuff if you want a heavy deck. I got the Havener Enterprise Sulkies. That one actually went with goes with the Ferris and he threw that in for free with the deal. I bought it from a guy off Craigslist, great dude. Um, he threw that in for free, so I thought that was cool. The only thing I don't like, it's not a click up one like this one is right here. So like I forgot how to hang it and I tried with this pin, but it's not strong enough, so I do have to figure something out uh, also these are pack and rack trimmer racks they're okay they're not great they're not bad but they're okay got some uh, just brush and some stuff leaves I cleaned up last job uh, back here we got the Ferris 48 inch comfort comfort control DD 48 inch walk behind hydro of course uh, got a I'm getting a new trash bag for that because that's actually off the Toro that I had last year. It, uh, I had one commercial property that filled up like three quarters of the bag. It was nuts because I haven't been picked up all winter. Uh, but yeah, I, I like it. It's a, a decent uh, setup. It works for me. It works for me. It may not necessarily work for you. I have, uh, oh, I was going to show you this. It's the Peckham Racks uh, line spool rack. See, to get free shipping on those racks, I had to order 100 bucks worth of stuff, and those were 80. That was like 25, I believe, or something. Either way, with tax, because it's from it was from a Missouri address it shipped. That's why it was had to pay tax online. It ended up being over 100, so I got free shipping, and that was the real reason why I ordered that. And just echo trimmer line, whatever. It's a $30 roll stuff from Home Depot for like 900 something feet. It works, you go through that stuff like uh, like underwear most of the time. But if you guys want to know, I have 20 weekly accounts. Hopefully I'll get 21, 22 if I ch get those two couple yards I've been chasing down. So far I'm excited for the season. Uh, I'll show you in here real quick. It's, it's not organized, don't even get me started. So, the Ryobi expanded system, which I want to steal combi this year. It all comes with money and whatever. And two cycle, regular gas. And 
yeah, that's that. If you guys have any questions on anything here, set up, I have a blower there. Let me know in the comments below, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.